Hello everyone, I'm Zornita and today we are having a look at an ultrasonic skin spatula, also known as a skin scrubber. What does it do? Do you need one? And my opinion of this particular brand I bought off of AliExpress. What is an ultrasonic skin spatula and how does it work? A skin scrubber is a small device that uses micro vibrations to loosen up dead cells, oil and dirt from the skin and scrub them away in a gentle way. It provides a physical exfoliation compared to the chemical ones done with AHAs and BHAs, alpha hydroxy and beta hydroxy acids. It is however superior to some of the methods of exfoliation with microbeads or crushed nuts as it works not only on the surface but also in the depth of the pores thanks to the micro vibrations. It can be used in spa salons before manual extraction of blackheads and sebaceous filament or as a standalone treatment to keep your pores clean and your skin exfoliated and illuminated. Some brands like the one here have additional modes besides the cleansing. This one has moisturizing and lifting. In the moisturizing mode, the appliance uses ionophoresis. This is a method of using a mild electric current and micro vibrations to help skin absorb the product. Use with your favorite moisturizer or cream to increase its effects and have well hydrated skin. In the lifting mode, the device produces gentle pulsations to improve the blood circulation, tighten the facial muscles and give your skin a supple and smooth look. How to use it? For the ultrasonic skin spatula to work in its cleansing mode, it needs to be used on wet skin. Take your makeup off and clean your face. For better results, you can steam your face before the procedure. When the skin is still wet, turn on the spatula and press it gently to the skin at an angle. Move it slowly and see how the gunk collects at the spatula. As the moisture on the skin evaporates rather quickly, my favorite way to use a skin scrubber is with cleansing emulsion. The skin scrubber has rounded edges that you can use around your nose and chin. For the moisturizing and lifting mode, turn the spatula around and hold it with the angled side touching your face. Is it effective? For cleansing, yes it is. I have large pores that can get easily clogged even after a couple of uses of the wrong product for my skin type. I have more than 4 years of experience with AHAs and BHAs and this small gadget still managed to impress me. For the moisturizing and especially for the lifting mode, you need to use the device for a longer period of time to see the results. My skin scrubber review. This is the exact seller from AliExpress that I bought the device from. It came with no box, just the device packaged in a bubble wrap, a small menu and a charging cable. Although browsing through another sellers on AliExpress, I see that some of them provide box. If it is important to you or you need it for a present, take a good look at the reviews and especially the ones with pictures. The brand is Skein, but this is rather random. Other brands on AliExpress and Amazon look exactly the same. It is made out of plastic, but it's well built and sturdy. The surface is a pearly, perfectly shiny and smooth one and the lid closes tightly. The spatula part itself is made of metal, probably stainless steel. It has smooth surface and edges. This particular ultrasonic skin spatula has one touch button for turning the device on and off and for changing the modes. When you turn it on, it lights up in blue to show the selected mode which is changed by a single press or rather a single touch of the button. There is a little bit of light around the spatula as well. Overall, I'm very satisfied with my purchase. My only issue is that the touch button is overly sensitive. It changes modes or it turns itself off unintentionally during use. So one has to be very careful on how they hold the scrubber. Is it worth it? The short answer is yes. You can extend the effect of a great facial and thus have a great skin with clean pores for longer. But can it substitute a facial completely? No, I don't think so, but it highly depends on your skin type and your skincare routine as well. The downsides are with the specific brand, as I said, it is overly sensitive, the price is fair and the effects are excellent for the cheap, nameless brand of a skin scrubber.
If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more practical and useful videos. I will see you again in my next one. Until then, stay happy and healthy. Bye!